been working from home more recently and I wanted to put a privacy strip on our office slash backroom door. So I'm going to use Derivan Gel Medium. You need to prep the window first by cleaning it with a good window cleaner. Say Derivan Healthy Clean window cleaner. I don't want to do the whole window. I'm just going to do a section. So I'm going to mark the area that I want to do out with painter's tape. I'm going to do this section with stripes with the sponge so I have to work quickly applying the gel medium. Once it's applied I'm then going to drag the sponge down so that I get these stripy lines. Now I want to apply a strip of green so I'm going to mix in the phthalo green in with the gel medium and this time I'm not going to do stripes I'm just going to do a mottled effect so I'm just going to dab it on. You need to pull the painter's tape off while the gel medium is still wet so you get a nice crisp line. The gel medium has dried now after a couple of hours and you really can't see through it. Notice the difference between the stripes and the green mottled line. To finish this off I'm going to do a keep out or else sign using the gel medium tinted with the magenta. So I have that stencil there and I've taped it to the window and now very carefully just applying the gel medium. Now it's dry, doesn't it look great? But how do I remove it? I hear you ask. Well, that's really easy. Let me show you how. Step one, you want to thoroughly wet the surface with a window cleaner. I'm also going to attach this cloth just to let it really soak in. Leave it for five minutes. Now you've waited five minutes, it will have soaked into the gel medium. So if you have yourself a plastic scraper, this is useful to start to begin to remove the film. You only need it to just get it started and then once it's started you can peel it off with your hands. This application up here was very thin so it's almost like blood wrap when you're pulling it off but it comes off really easily. Now I'm going to attack that bottom section again using a wet cloth and putting some extra window cleaner over the top and leaving for five minutes. This strip of gel medium was applied a bit thicker than the top section, so it just comes off easily in your hands. Now all that's left to do is to remove the keep out or else sign. And you can see how easily this is just peeling off. It's so easy to remove. You can choose, you can either use it as a permanent or a temporary frosted glass effect. 